Hello, this is our garden. It is just a balcony, but it's a good start. I also use half of it for some woodworking projects. I might share it in the future. For the last four months, I had great success <coughs> and not so much. Can you imagine? We have been caring and loving those plants and they turn to be not some tasty tomatoes, but horseweed. Yeah. Also, I don't think it's a good idea to grow weed on your balcony. In the beginning, we had 19 tomato plants and only seven survived, but it's still much better than last year. This year we have a lot of tomatoes. They're very, very big. Growing those tomatoes was amazing, but next year I have so much seeds I'm gonna try. My name is Alex and this Hello, is Tati. Tati. We moved to Lithuania five years ago and we always rented, whole our life we rented. And this is our first apartment we got and this is the bot <laughs> <laughs> and the first balcony, like that is our balcony. And it's so huge! For us, yes, yes. For us it's very huge, but for growing it's a different thing so uh it's it's a challenge because i have plans to grow everything but it's very probably hard to grow in big quantities so my plan is to grow uh, everything i need but in small quantity like one plant maybe i will have a couple of potatoes <laughs> like in a small half meter <laughs> just to see how it grows maybe a bit garlic and see how it grows so it will be a challenge and uh, right now I'm planning as much as I can because next year, you saw my seeds, I will try to grow as much as I can in this 8 meters uh, balcony. We also have those. And mint and basilic. And chamomile. Chamomile? Chamomile. Yes, chamomile. And the red tomatoes that we will try for the first time. Oh my god, what a smell! We are trying for the first time. Mm. It's very soft. Yes. Mm. It was worth it. I love it too. I also tried hydroponics. It was amazing. But one day the plant mysteriously disappeared. Hydroponics is when plants are grown just in water, without any soil. They should grow three times faster and can be grown at home with a lamp. It sounds amazing. I plan to try tomatoes at home and if all goes well, I will try strawberries. I really like the concept of self-sustain. I really like uh, to be able to know that you can uh, use your two hands to make something. Uh, it makes me feel safe, I can say, because I can relate on myself and I know that in any situation I can just use a knife to make some furniture, I'm doing some also learning to do woodworking stuff, instruments, I can plant uh, different stuff. Right now I'm limited, I, I planted a couple of plants but, but soon, soon I will be planting a lot of stuff. I also collecting a bit of books. I found this book, it's based on a very old book. Uh, and it got very interesting illustration. This is what also I got it because I'm also drawing a bit. So I, I like to check it out, but it got some interesting tips. Uh, it's beginner, beginner, but, it, but it's still good enough for me. And also I found this new garden encyclopedia. It's 1936, it's a very old book, but it also got interesting information. And again, very beautiful illustrations. Uh, yeah, I like those illustrations. <laughs> but it got very interesting information, how to harvest, pest, disease, how to grow stuff. Um, so this year I think it's over because it will be very cold in one month. But next year I will try to grow everything I bought and uh, probably even more. We'll see. I will try to grow all this balcony completely. Uh, so it will be a very interesting project for me. Thank you.